We've got a lot of citizens and a lot of people that are still got a lot of damage to homes, a lot of repairs to do that I feel sorry for. A local community still dealing with damage from storms this year will not get help from the federal government. The state of North Carolina has learned FEMA denied an appeal for a major disaster declaration for the deadly mudslides in May. Emergency officials, others in Polk County say they are disappointed by the decision. 7 News Nikel Smith explains how the money could have helped and what's next for those in need. It's been almost six months since Mother Nature forever changed life off Highway 176 in Polk County. Patricia Case was killed in mudslides last May, and several properties were destroyed or damaged. Thanksgiving's next week without my mom. Christmas is around the corner, and you know, I just I don't um, I don't have the words to describe how hard it is. Patricia Case's family tells me that they're not getting help from the insurance company, so it's like they're having to deal with a loss in more ways than one. And my dad lost his home. My mom lost her life. And, and they weren't the only ones to lose. FEMA denied the state's appeal for a major disaster declaration for the period of May 15 to 31st. I can't believe that they felt like Nothing is enough. You know, the damage isn't enough. The loss wasn't enough. So they say there's too much time between the, the landslides in Alberto, but to us, we was in response mode by the time the landslides hit and preparing for Alberto. So we thought we thought we could get we could get that declaration. Arledge says it could have helped the county's roughly eighty thousand dollar costs for overtime and other damage, and it could have helped individuals with their properties. A lot of insurance didn't cover the land land movement and landslides. That FEMA money definitely could have cleared that debt to where he's not stuck owing on a home that you know he will never be able to live in again. She hopes the state can notice the need and step in to help. Reporting in Polk County, Nickel Smith, 7 News. The Polk County Emergency Management Director says they're hoping to get a state disaster declaration. Governor Roy Cooper's office released a statement saying they're disappointed with FEMA's decision and are moving forward to provide more state help for Western North Carolinians affected by those storms.